Hello everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. I'm Hydrogen Man. So guys, today I'm going to share with you how to enhance and maximize and accelerate the healing process and even the anti-aging effects of hydrogen. So you can get the most out of it um, in regards to all the benefits that it can potentially bring you. Before I go on, obviously I'm not giving you guys any medical advice. I just want to let you know this. And also stay tuned, definitely watch the whole video because at the very end of the video, I'm actually gonna give you guys the strongest, most powerful tools in order to maximize the benefits from hydrogen. So the very first thing actually is more of a cautionary thing. Beware of bad advice, guys. I keep noticing that there's so much bad advice out there as far as whether how to use hydrogen, how to make hydrogen. And you gotta beware of that because some of it can even cause damage to you and you won't get the most out of hydrogen. So just beware of that. I'll always keep you guys up to date on the latest and greatest from Japan because they're way ahead of everybody in regards to this technology and information. And also even the equipment. So if there's any, if there's anything ever better than the, than the equipment that I use, which is really the best that I have found, um, I'll always keep you guys up to date on that. But let's go ahead and get started so I can share with you guys how to get the most out of hydrogen. First thing is, guys, anything that creates a lot of free radical damage or ultimately is bogging down your body, you really want to try to eliminate or minimize these things because let's just use an example. The first one is a clean diet, guys. It, you know, let's say you eat food that is not organic and is filled with pesticides, or let's say you eat a lot of processed or junk food and drinking soda pop and all these types of things, okay? This is going to create a lot of free radical damage within the body, and then you use hydrogen. And yeah, it brings it down, and there's, that's a great benefit of hydrogen. But if you don't do that in the first place, and then you use hydrogen, now you're going the other way, and it really allows hydrogen to do more for you. That's one way to accelerate healing and just get the most out of hydrogen. Now, the next thing that I want to touch on is proper sleeping hours and obviously the amount of hours that you sleep and then the time that you go to sleep. Sleep is really, really important. But here's the thing, doing inhalation before you sleep is going to, again, maximize the healing process for you because during the day, you get a lot of free radical damage in the brain and the brain helps the body go through certain processes at night that help the body heal. That's why sleep is super, super important. If you do the inhalation before you go to bed, you sleep better, you know, ultimately deeper and the body will heal better at night. So that's one of my tips. And I personally would recommend drinking a little bit of hydrogen water before the inhalation. Again, that's another way to maximize and get the most out of hydrogen. All right, now let's move on to the next point. Um, we are talking a little bit about proper equipment because a lot of hydrogen equipment out there will either leach metal when you're directly ionizing the water, especially the Chinese devices and the Korean devices. They leach the metals, again, causing a certain level of metal toxicity. Hydrogen has to deal with this stuff. In long term, it will cause issues even though you're getting the hydrogen. I've seen it where research will show that it'll still cause issues. Hydrogen can't just fix everything. So really beware of that. And beware of like the hydrogen pills and tablets. People are always asking me about this. Japan realized that it was causing cirrhosis of the liver and long-term usage, Alzheimer's and infertility in women, guys. And you're going to want to use hydrogen for the long term if you want to get the most out of it also. So it's really important to make it cleanly. You don't want devices that are using chemicals to make the hydrogen. Again, you don't want to use poor metal technology. You don't want to change. You don't want water ionizers or like when they change the pH of the water. Again, that's another thing that's going to keep hydrogen from doing what it should be doing for you, you know, to the maximum level. Because changing the pH is going to cause issues with your GI and your stomach. So just make sure to get the proper equipment. Um, you're going to get the most out of hydrogen water also when you get nano bubbles. So you, this is going to be something really important. Also, another tip that I have is using both hydrogen water and hydrogen gas inhalation. The combination is also going to enhance and you're going to be able to get the most that you can potentially get out of hydrogen. And then, of course, proper levels within the water and the proper levels uh, in the inhalation are other ways to get the most out of it. Now that's actually going to bring me to my next point, which is having clean water. Again, if you have chemicals in the water, chlorines, fluorides, pesticides, all sorts of stuff, more free radical damage, then hydrogen has to fight against that. It's almost like hydrogen's having to, you know, work uphill or swim against the current when we're doing things like this. So if we drink the clean water and we minimize these things, then hydrogen can go the other direction and really begin to help our bodies heal at a much more rapid rate. So that's another thing that I personally suggest. Now let's talk a little bit about pure hydrogen versus hydrogen mixed with oxygen or otherwise known as Brown's gas or HHO. So based on the research, pure hydrogen is the better way to go. So if you want to get the most out of hydrogen, that's the best way to go. With the mixture of oxygen and hydrogen, you still get some of the benefits of the hydrogen. It's just not as much. You're not maximizing based on the research that I've seen. And that's another one that I, that I can definitely suggest to you guys. And probably the most powerful thing that I've come across that I've been using, and it's just been absolutely great, guys. This is the product that I've been using. This fenbendazole is the main ingredient. The reason that, that it's going to help you enhance hydrogen so much 
is because it, the, the way it kills parasites and worms and all these little critters basically within the body that create a lot of free radical damage within your body. I mean, these things literally are sucking the life out of you. They suck the life force. They really like your blood also, which is why they like to, I mean, they're all over the body, but they really like to be in your colon. And the reason is because all the nutrients will come through there and they will eat those nutrients, which means you won't get them and you can become deficient very easily. And then they defecate inside of you, creating a lot of toxicity, a lot of free radical damage, a lot of inflammation. And then hydrogen has to combat that. And you're not going to be able to get the most out of hydrogen. So if you can kill these guys or greatly reduce them, and you know, a lot of people may think, oh, I don't have any bugs or parasites. Guys, everybody's got them. I mean, if you've ever eaten pork, if you've ever eaten meat, and even if you haven't fish, there's just so many things out there that have these little critters and it's really hard just not to get them. It's a very common thing and it's nothing to be embarrassed about. It's just something that would be incredibly good for us to clean our bodies. And then when you use hydrogen, again, you're going to maximize what you can get out of hydrogen. I've been having this has actually impressed me more than I ever expected that it would. It's It's been absolutely incredible and it's very inexpensive. In fact, I'll put some links down below if you guys want to use it. I've made some other videos on that, so you can definitely check that out. It's been absolutely incredible. And beyond that, guys, the only other thing that I will share with you guys is that I, I'm going to be sharing some new hydrogen technology and information that, again, is going to allow you to maximize and get the most out of hydrogen in the near future. So don't forget to hit the notification bell and don't forget to subscribe down below. And that's it, guys. Thanks for watching the video. Thanks for supporting the channel. Give the video a thumbs up. Support the channel. I really appreciate that from you guys. And I'll see you guys next time on the next video. Thanks for watching.